percent of people stick to that New Year's resolution, but you do not have to be one of them. Yes, even if you've given up on your resolution just 10 days in, it's not too late to get back on track. And only on News 5, our Shayla Jordan is watching out for your health and joins us with more. All right, get us back on track, Shayla. Good morning, Iron Bree. That's right. If your New Year's resolution is to get back into the gym or live a healthier lifestyle, you are not alone. And lucky for you, I'm here with an expert this morning on the topic. Philip, talk to me. You see a lot of people in and out of the gym every day, but if someone is at home, they're trying to stick to that New Year's resolution, what are some things that they can do? Yeah, definitely. You know, so one of the key things you can do would be planning, you know, so to plan your meals, uh, plan your workouts, prioritize, you know, don't leave it to chance. Um, another thing would be food tracking. So, you know, you want to plan your meals, uh, know your calories, you know, know your numbers. And I recommend MyFitnessPal. It's a free um, online app that you can use. Um, and then also is going to be accountability. Um, accountability will be crucial. So have a workout buddy, um, join a group or, you know, get a trainer. Um, somebody that's going to keep you motivated and keep you about accountable and keep you on track. So. All right, and speaking yeah. of accountability, Philip is holding me accountable this morning, and these are a couple workouts yeah. that you can do at home. Um, I was night. hoping for the pink band, but I heard that that <laughs> one's a little more challenging. So I've got the purple one over here, and right. you're starting with the. Cool, yeah. So first, you're going to put one foot on, other foot off to the side, and then open your palms facing forward, bend your legs, okay. and you're just going to do a low chest fly. You just go straight ahead, arms extended, and just go straight up. And you keep your core nice and tight, so you're working your chest. And your core is working. Ooh, yep. Getting my workout this morning. There you go. There and these you go. are something that people can purchase, right? Yeah, these are not ex uh, expensive at all. You can pick these up anywhere and you can easily use these at home as a good workout tool. So, okay. definitely. You had um, another one in Yeah, place. another one. So, you bring that foot to the front this all time. Right. And then now you lift your hands up, elbows up high, and then straight up overhead. You got a shoulder press. So, again, core is working, going overhead. You got your shoulders working. Nice big breathing. That'll be a great one for the upper body strength. Oh. I'm glad oh, I yeah. stuck with the easier band. All right, and I think you have one more. <laughs> and then me. the last one to work your legs is step on with both feet and then lift your hands back up again. Okay, kind of in that 90 degree position. Okay. And then now you're just squatting. Stay back on your heels. And now you have the resistance from the band. All right, as you're going up and down into that squat. Nice. Yep. You got oh it, just like gosh. that. There Perfect. There you go. You have a full body workout at <laughs> full home. Full body, right at home. Easy. All right, well, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Absolutely. We'll be out here all morning long giving you tips on your New Year's resolutions and helping you stay on track. For now, watching out for you from Colorado Springs, Shayla Gerard in News 5. All right, thank you, Shayla. Let's still